Hey guys, it's Cugsley and welcome back to another video. So, I may have made a mistake. Uh, not a mistake per se, but rather a decision that hindsight 2020 um, it may not have been the easiest decision to make. It's a good thing I didn't think about it very hard until just now. So you might be wondering, why am I staring at the simple wall segment used for my SCP game? Well. Um, for those of you who saw my Discord messages, uh, you got to know ahead of time, but um, everyone, I am uh, going to update my SCP game, and I'm going to make a huge update for it in that. Um, yeah, so let me be more specific here. So I've taken a huge break off of it because I've finished a good chunk of it, so I'm really happy with it. It's a, it's a complete game. Um, but I feel like there's definitely stuff I can do. Let me uh, open this up. For example, if I go in here, right, um, there we go. If I go in here, a lot of these scenes are practically filled to the brim, and one of these scenes, this one, is just straight up not done. So I'm going to go in and optimize literally everything. Now, what do I mean by that? Well, oh boy, here we go. So, if I go over to this wall segment here, this is a good example. Let's go into the versions and releases. The wall segment costs 6% graphics. Like, just, it just costs 6 it's a lot. I lowered it to 3%, I cut it in half. Uh, and I'm currently going through every single- there it is, now it's back at 2, but it looks not as sharp. So really, this is a good- Kinda looks- see, see that? Look at that. It, it, it's a good compromise. So now, um, instead of looking like, let me actually, no, wait, 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 I have a better idea. Let me go out, um, let me go here, and simple wall segment. Alright, so now here's what it looks like, right? Doesn't look too different uh, until you get a uh, view corner, let's stamp this one. I want to stamp this one. So now you can kind of see the difference. Uh, the line is slightly thicker and if you go in it's just it, 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 it's just ever so slightly fuzzier. Right? Small graphics change but this is going to allow me a lot, a lot a lot more space when working on my SCP game now. Uh, so I'm going to do that. I've also optimized the SCP doors as well. So, now I'm optimizing for logic too. My main idea is to literally make this game just completely different. I want to revamp it. I want it to run faster. I want it to. Ha I want to have more space to work with. This costs 4% graphics. I'm not too happy about it. And it costs 1% gameplay memory. But it used to be where there's a microchip on both ends. Now there's only one microchip right here. You see there's a keyframe that activates both doors. We have two tags, one for each side. I have gone into an optimization spree. Everything here is even more organized than it was before, and I'm going to basically try and make everything work wherever I can. It's like, for example, do I really need the top of this door to look this, this flashy and nice? No one's ever going to see the top of this door. They shouldn't. There hasn't been a single scenario where they have, so you know what I'm going to do? Obviously, I'm going to loosen up, I'll loosen it up all the way. I want to save every single bit of, let's not do it to the edges though. Um, I want to save every single bit of memory I can because I'm going to go and try and optimize whatever I can. Now, I cannot guarantee that the update will actually come out because unfortunately, if I can't optimize everything to the degree that I want to, then I, I'm just not going to update it because there's no point, right? But I'm trying. So there should be something new coming out in around a month. That's probably how long it'll take for me to optimize everything I have and then add some stuff that's new. Uh, some of the thing, yeah, some of the things I want to add that are new, uh, it's going to be, I, I want to try and add random map generation. I think I have an idea for how I could make it work while not breaking the laws of physics in game. Um, like you know, like having rooms in different scenes overlap into where rooms would be in other scenes. I want to try to avoid that and make it as realistic as possible in that aspect. 
uh, just all this stuff. I'm working on it. One big problem right now, though, isn't actually, uh, it isn't graphics, it's actually gameplay. So if I do map one, sorry, I added this, that's why I changed it to have a space. If I go in here, and I'll let you guys see this, right, because it's been a bit. If you look at this map here, you'll see that I have 94% graphics. That's not too bad, though, unless I add something new in. But the gameplay is insane at 88%. And one big problem are these little red chips right here. Watch this. Delete one. Boom. Down 1%. Uh, so here's what happens if I delete all of them. Uh, there's a lot of stuff here. Spawn chip. If I delete... Did I, did I select all of them? Did I? No, no, we're not, we're not selecting all of them. I, now I'm no, I, I'm no, uh, no expert, but that was definitely, oh no, SCP spawn ship, whoops. Uh, where is that? Ah, here it is. So, if I delete all 14 of these, then, well, it goes down only nine, only, only 9%. Well, it goes down 9%, so that's a start, right? Uh, so let's see here. Uh, my plan is to delete all of those and add a different method that'll make it way easier, and I can add to different areas as well. Um, I already updated the uh, SCP door, so if I do this, though, it's going to add a graphics overload, but that will also decrease gameplay just by a smidge. All right, graphics, please don't kill me. Come on, don't, don't kill me. I'm begging you, don't. Graphics, I'm I'm begging you, because I haven't updated everything graphics way. Uh, now here's where it's gonna get really angry. I'm about to update this. This has the updated graphics stuff for my uh for, for the gates. It is, it's not gonna be happy with this. It is going to explode on the graphics setting because all the other scene, all all the other items are older items. So now there's two. It's just gonna blow up. Plus. Oh, so now uh, you can see we're at 78. Before I updated that, we were at 79. So I, as you can see, it, it went down a, a pixel, which is pretty cool, all things considered. And if everything else were up to date, let's see how it looks. It should still look pretty nice. Yeah, it doesn't look that bad, really. Uh, I definitely can't complain. I feel like it, it the downsizing wasn't too bad at all it's it's a little little fuzzy now but uh, honestly I feel like it's worth it given that my game is practically falling apart at the seams it's like when you play it it seems like everything's well put together uh, when I'm looking at it from a bird's eye view though everything is literally falling apart so the idea is that I'm going to fix this and you know better glue together this game because where it's at right now it is struggling immensely. There is old logic conflicting with new logic, and there's a bunch of poorly made patches with the logic to make it work. Like, for example, because I updated that uh, new scene over there now, uh, there's probably some old logic and new logic directly conflicting. Um, I'm sorry, did I see two on top of something there? Or? No, I didn't. It's so, like, watch this, watch this. I'm going to go in here, right? I'm going to look at this, and it looks normal until I move something, or... Move, move something. Oh, move something. Move something. Oh, uh, never, never mind. Oh, oh, wait, 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 wait. I can just put that. Wait, no, it should be on right now, right? It should be dysfunctional. All right, cool. Connected. No, all right, cool. So there we go. That's actually good logic right there. Just connected and automatic, ah, and it automatically works. So yeah. I'm going to go through a complete and total reworking of this game and make it better. Hopefully, in the process, I'll also figure out a way to bring the graphics back up. I gotta find out what's taken up all this uh, graphics costs. Uh, sculpture data. Ouch. That, that, that's bad. It's... That's really bad. Um, I... I genuinely don't know where it's coming from, though, because most of these are reused assets. It could be from this room, probably. That likely costs a lot. No, it only costs 2%. Okay, how about this room? This is a huge room. 
That's 5%. Not really. This one? Okay, so it's all just nickel and diming then. I got it. But yeah, so that's what I'm going to do. Um, I will not be posting like regular updates about this as I go along, but just rest assured that it's probably being done. And if I hit a roadblock and I know for a fact I can't pass it, then I'll, I'll let you guys know. That way you're not, you know, waiting indefinitely. Well, I uh, hope you guys enjoyed, and I'm going to start that cheese review now. So, yeah, I'll, I'll see you shortly. Hope you guys have a wonderful day, and bye-bye. Uh,